Hi everyone, my name is Eric Scherter and I'm the product manager for the static site editor group in the create stage of the DevOps workflow here at GitLab. And I want to talk to you about what we have planned for the 13.0 milestone, which is going to be a really exciting one for our group. Coming off of 12.10, where we've finally shipped a, a MVC within the application itself for the static site editor, we're looking to iterate and improve the editing experience by providing a WYSIWYG or what you see is what you get markdown editor instead of the, the raw text field that's in there right now. We'll also be focused on um, addressing some technical debt that was introduced as part of our MVC and uh, working on some pipeline performance improvements and optimization for the GitLab handbook. But I wanna to talk to you specifically about the WYSIWYG editor. And our goal here is to um, reduce the, the mental overhead required for editing within, uh, editing the markdown content within the static site editor. And we, we feel like the focus should be on the content and not the, uh, the number of hashtags in front of your content or the format of your links and how to properly format markdown tables. So within the static site editor, we're looking to introduce um, a rich text visual editor that's capable of, of formatting text uh, with all the standard uh, syntax like bold, italic, underline, strike through, inline code. And we'll also be looking to add page elements from Markdown into the uh, editor as well. So things like being able to add a, a pull quote or a bulleted list or um, code blocks and um, images. So uh, the biggest improvement here will be working with tables within the Markdown editor. Um, as, as many people know, working with tables in Markdown can be a bit tedious and um, error prone. So a visual table editor is gonna be a, a cornerstone feature of this editor. Uh, and I'll take, uh, show you what it could look like. It's pretty straightforward. We're gonna have um, a formatting bar and uh, rich text editor um, reflecting the heading sizes and uh, link styles and everything um, consistent with GitLab's CSS. Very excited for this change. I think this is gonna be a, a, a dramatic improvement to the editing process and I'm excited to see how you use it. Thank you very much, and we'll see you next release.